Good morning, hello, good afternoon here on uh, this July, Tuesday 18. It's around uh, 4 p.m. here in the afternoon. And uh, yeah, today we have an amazing day, more or less a blue sky here. And uh, the temperature is around uh, 26 degrees Celsius. It's a perfect summer day. Not many until now this year in the summer like that with uh, more or less blue sky. Earlier the sky was really blue, now we have some clouds. And yes, we are starting here in uh, Portas de Mar. I will show you here what's going on in the high season, because it's high season, it's in the middle of, the, of uh, July here and then Europe uh, summer. And uh, yeah, this is high season, but for the high season, for me, it looks like here very, very quiet, not uh, uh, many people, but I think we can see more people there on the beaches. And here we have the new home house boats here. You can rent this for uh, nights or uh, uh, longer, but they are very expensive. It's uh, one night, it's over 200 euros. For that price, you can go here to a four-star hotel here, like uh, Marina Atlantico. Also here, uh, here we have some Italians. Ciao, bello. <laughs> some Italians, yes. Wow, and here we have a, a big yacht here. Yeah. Also there in the back with the jet ski. Yeah, this is the yacht from Poland. It's uh, here a long time now, here. And you can see here it's very quiet at this time, high season, nobody's here now. And soon we are arriving here to the first beach, but it's it's more a, a natural pool here in the Port of Tamar. Here we have some restaurants, but of course at this time, usually the people don't eat at 4 p.m. here. And here we have another location. It's also not uh, very busy here for the high season. You can see some empty tables at this time here. And here is busy now, huh? many people here in the Port de Stamar here. It's open here or with uh, security staff here from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. here. And here we have many people that I can show you there from uh, here again. Go. Porto Stamar at this time is very, very quiet. Yeah, yesterday was in the news a new record with the passengers. Nothing before like the last June, uh, but I can't see these people. I don't know where are these people. Here you can see it's very, very busy at this time. Because the weather is perfect, no wind, and it's warm. Yeah. And there on the left side, there is the other pool, but there you have to pay. Here it's free in Porta Stamar. Today it's a perfect day here to enjoy here. The sea, there is also two lifeguards. Many of them are Spanish. I don't know why, but yeah, some of them from Spain.
El Zaid, all the pool area, it's busy. Here in front, this is the area for all the children here. It's not uh, very deep here. But also at this time here, many, many people. It's And here is the entrance here to the pool here. Maybe we can see here some more information. It's also open here from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. all days now. But the prices, I don't know how much here. Ah, here the prices. It's 35 a piscina de San Pedro because we are here in San Pedro. It's uh, adults, 2 euro 50. And uh, over 66 years, it's uh, 150. Also the children, 150. It's not very expensive here, you can see the price. Ah, here we have also in English, I see here, yes. Yeah. Okay. This is here on the other side here from the Hotel Marina Atlantica here. This side. And here I am coming from Portas de Mar from like the city center. And now I will go to San Rock. There we have more beaches and uh, there is one of the most busiest beach here in Ponta Delgada. Ah, and here, look, the people are coming back from the oil watching. Maybe it's also an amazing day today for that, because we can see here today to South Africa, the other islands, and the distance is around 100 kilometers. The, the view today is amazing here. It's a, it's a perfect summer day. It's also busy here. It's the other company, Picos de Aventura here. And on this side we have uh, the Provisorio. It's a hot spot, normally night time, day Saturday. Yeah. Now I will uh, here go to Sarok here. And here the Octant, the five-star hotel here, rooms around uh, 300 euros per night. It's not cheap here. If you think the minimum salary for the Portuguese uh, people is 750. <laughs> and here at night it's over 300. Crazy. And I don't know they are fully booked this year or not. I don't have information. Hey, the restaurant Klupena. Now all here, there was a, a remodeling here, it's now a nice place inside here. And 
dear one time more the view back over Porta Stamar and here the Hotel Octant Vita Casino and I'm here on the bicycle way here And I'm uh, going now to Zarok. There we have three other beaches. The biggest and the nicest and the busiest beach they are here. Not in the close to the center, they are here outside in uh, Zarok. Praia de Popolo, Praia Formosa. And here too much traffic. I don't know why not more uh, people using here a bicycle. The local people here, I have to say sorry one time more, they are very lazy. Too much cars now on these islands. I was driving uh, last Saturday night from uh, Ribeira Grande here to Ponta Delgada. And uh, that was crazy around 2.33 a.m. in the morning, a lot of cars. was also driving from uh, Ribeira Grande to Ponte Delgada. They're on the old street because on the other, on the highway, I can't drive. It's uh, not allowed with the bicycle. And I don't know what the people doing at this time, but it uh, was, was very, very busy. And uh, for me, the island here needs uh, a limit from the cars. We have now too much cars. But Ponta Delgada is too something inside uh, from the city center there. We have always more uh, the area there in uh, the area from Porta Sta Cidade there. It's not anymore allowed to drive. It's closed for the traffic, for the public, also for the taxis now. And there it's uh, very nice. I hope uh, the city will do, will extend this uh, area. You can see here, nobody, the bicycle, and also not many people here walking at this time here. There I see one guy with the bicycle. Here we can't see now Santa Maria, but a little bit higher, yes. In front of my house there, I can see very good uh, now here. It's here, like in the middle from the picture now is Santa Maria, but here we can't see, we, are, we need to be higher to see here. And also we have now uh, some clouds. It is nice at this time, it's a uh, fresh wind, not too strong. Here some people walking with the children's. Here's a fish restaurant, Marisera. And also here you can see a 
two, four, six, eight, 13 people here. It's very quiet. I can't see the high season. For me, it looks like everything, like uh, low season. It's uh, very interesting this year. I see less people than uh, in the year 2020, the C19 year. I think we have only this uh, high amount from the flights because of some immigrants. They are visiting this year, the family, the friends, but usually they don't go out, some of them, and uh, they have their own place to stay you now. They are like locals, not really locals, but they are acting like locals and many locals now at this time, they are also on vacation. And uh, of that, yeah, Ponta Delgada is very quiet. And uh, it's not a lot going on here in the city. Last year we have the Notte Steverao and uh, also the, the town hall doing less Notte Steverao events. It's only Friday, Saturday. Last year was also on uh, Tuesday, Wednesday. But for me, it looks like Ponta Delgada. It's going to a city for retired people over 60, over 65. And here we are soon, here on the next beach. Some people are here, I will go here. This is uh, Vorno da Col, the name here. And they're called Sona Balneada Forno da Cal. It's like the Forno da Cal beach. It's not a big spot here. And also we have here the lifeguards. It's a little bit windy, yeah. The sea, it's not very quiet at this time here. Yeah, then I will go here to the next beach. This is Sarok. We are here now in Sarok. Here you can go down and uh, then you are here. There are the lifeguards, like Baywatch, red. Red and yellow, yeah. Yeah, here it's some people, but here it's today not very, very busy. For another call here, calls this beach here. Here we have another fish restaurant here. And here we have some people also here close to the beach. Here on this side. There on the left side is the other beach by the Popolo. I will go to there now. Here.
here we have an interruption here from the bicycle way here And soon I can give you here uh, an amazing view here in this area. We have here a uh, Mira Dodo. I don't know what's called it in English. Mira Dodo. It's like a, po uh, a watching point now. Uh, I have only here to save my bike. But I can do that there, yeah, okay. Here, this small house is from the Spiritu Santo. I give you short here the view here to Sarok on this side, and then I'm back. Just a short moment. Only here to look my bike. We never know. Yes, well down. Arosto Docao here. Military fortifications of the Arosto Docao. Ah, here we have some. But here, if we go up here, we have an amazing view here. Here, some parts from San Rock, Freguesia here from Ponte Delgada, one of the bigger Freguesias here. And here we are on top. Here the view, the part. The fish restaurant, Guys Vente. Here you have a good view over one part from Ponte Delgada. It's also here a fresh wind, it's perfect. Ah, and here they are diving, eh? here.
now some clouds, yeah. But the weather forecast for today, it's it's a good no rain. I'll take a short look here in the chat before I go forward to the next beaches. Rafael Oliveira Gamer, right there on my fish, I said the man and I let a pico and I can yeah, I can't go to Pico. It's I I'm only here in San Miguel. Fatima Correa, but I was there last summer, beautiful place. Facebook, Lindo Dia, Fatima Braga, Paolo Rodriguez, San Miguel Azores, yes. Saudades de estar ahí ahora de andarte a un estado a ver los USA, USA. Nice, nice, nice. Zarok, ya costa para mí, yes. Ahora voy a ir en Zarok. And now I will go here to the next beaches. And you see now we have only people on the beaches. There are some animals, cows, maybe a horse. Here they're doing a fire. Okay. Yeah, so I, I like Sarok so here because you have the beaches. It's a, it's a big freguesia and it's very good located here. And it's not far from the city center. It's uh, one of my favorites, but also Livramento. But Livramento, the most of the houses, they are not uh, very close to the beach. Not far, but here we have many he houses here. They are very close to the beach, to the sea. There we have another small beach, but it's not really a beach. It's more like in Ponta Delgada here, like a natural pool. No sand here, only stones. If you are coming here with the car here, you have the parking lot, not many, but some here. If you wanna enjoy, enjoy the view here. And this is also close here, Levi Levi. Here was before, before C19 here, a hotspot for the nightlife, but it's closed. We don't have a real nightlife here in Ponta Delgada. Here it's also an interruption here from the bicycle way here. So you have to drive here. Short short distance here in the normal street. 
and somehow here the bicycle way road is back enjoying a beer here, why not? There are the dogs <laughs> on the wall. Here we have uh, some alojamento local here, apartments for rent, short time for the tourists. And everything here I'm driving now, it's apart from Sahok. And uh, soon we are here on the next beach, Sand Beach. Here we have some people. Because here is a very nice beach and it's not too big. We'll drive now to the other side there we have the better view. Here also the, the bicycle road here is finished. High traffic now here. Here we are. This beach is close here to the church here in Zarok. There, church. Also a very nice place here. It's busy here today. Not very busy, but it's busy. Sometimes here we have more people. Here is the church. Igreja de Zarok. And we are soon here on the next beach on the biggest the street here also very bad
the reeds are here and many places in very, very bad conditions. And here is the parking lot here for the beach. Popolo. Here we have also the life cards. And here you have always a free space. Then the next beach, it's usual the busiest beach here. We will see today how busy is there. Here we have uh, some restaurants, bars here. There's also a lot of space here to walk. The biggest speech here from Ponte Vergara. There also is a big uh, parking lot here. A lot of space here. Now I show you here the beach. The last here in Ponta de Gana. <laughs> Parking lot is full, nobody using a bicycle. Here <laughs> yeah, no free no free space for the cars. I rent a car here, this uh, black Mercedes Mick Auto. And here you can see here this is the the busiest beach. It's not the biggest but whoops. the people really 
love this beach here. It's always very, very busy. Maybe they love the waves, I don't know why. Um, can I save my bike here and check out, maybe? And I can walk down. No, oh, here it's no, nothing here. But you can see here the people. I can a little bit zoom in here, yeah. It's like in Spain or in Italy, France and the Mediterranean Sea or some places in the States here. There we have also a, a restaurant bar here, this area. And also the lifeguards. Yeah. These are the beaches here from Ponto Delgada. And uh, after that, it's a Livramento. There is not the big beaches. And uh, after Livramento, Lagoa. They also don't have uh, beaches, sand beaches like here. This is a very nice place. And uh, it's very busy today, but I have seen here maybe two weeks ago on a, on a perfect Sunday here was full. Also here on this side was crazy, was crazy. But also now, yeah, you can see here high season, Ponte Delgada, all the people are now on the beaches. City is very quiet. I will give you here to end this beach stream here, the view. Here to the sea. And yeah, today it's a perfect day here to go to the beach. I say thanks for watching. Until next time, here direct from uh, Sagok. Punta Delgada, have a nice afternoon or morning if you're watching in California or on another place in the US West Coast. And uh, yeah, until next time, but that's obrigadissimo and uh, ciao, bye bye, here from direct from the Praia here in Zarok. <laughs>